on a hot and sunny day in Norman, Oklahoma, number 17, Florida State, is ready to take on 10th ranked Oklahoma. And here come the Sooners onto Owen Field, where they haven't lost since the 2005 season opener against TCU. They've won 31 straight home games since, 51 of 52 overall. He led the ACC in touchbacks last year. You saw DeMarco Murray among those back deep to receive, back with Moses Madu, who's returning today from a one-week suspension, didn't play last week, and there's that booming leg of Hopkins, sending it over the head of Murray and through the end zone, down on the field in a row. That was the longest streak of offensive line starting combinations last year when they were decimated by injuries. Murray, his first catch of the year, up the sideline where passes out of the backfield for Oklahoma. There's Broyles again, and the Sooners are sharp on the opening East corner of the state, he tells us. Town of about 10,000 people. Has a man open, and another first down to the 33-yard line of Florida State. Ryan Broyles again, 16. There took over a defense among the worst in college football. Turned it into a very effective unit. And a first down, good run after the catch by the true freshman, Kenny Stills. And Landry Jones is just just slowing things down and taking what exactly what the defense is open. And then Kenny battles for the first down and has it inside the 10. Jay Millard is in at fullback, leading the way for Murray. And he scores a touchdown. The official on the near side signaled touchdown. He just did get in. And Oklahoma, Patrick O'Hara, to kick the extra point. One of the issues for Oklahoma this year is that place kicker. O'Hara was just very smart. Excellent instincts. Jermaine Thomas took the handoff, turned the corner, and went across midfield to the big contrast in the offensive lines. Oklahoma didn't have one player who started on the O-line last week who started the season opener for them last year. Burt Reed the catch. 13 more. The time they struggled, Utah State passed for 341 yards. Greg Reed takes off running. He took the direct snap. Ponder has his man for a first down inside the 20. Bo Relaford, the tight end, with the first catch by a tight end. Some thought Ponder might come out for the NFL. He rolls right, he's in trouble. Shows that running ability. Might get to the end zone, he's down at the one. Sean, we said at the start of the game that when you... Pryor in at fullback in front of Jermaine Thomas. Leading the way for Thomas. Touchdown, Florida State. <laughs> That was huge, Sean. Came back and answered it the way they had to answer. And now Dustin Hopkins to tie it with an extra point. He's made 42 of those in a row now. Second and five, Landry Jones with all day to throw and a good catch by DeMarco Murray. Terrence Parks had the coverage. Well, it runs well between the tackles. Who played some wide receiver last year. Nice play action fake. And a run for a first down by Lance. Do carried for eight yards during that day. Second and a long two. And the do again inside the 20 and a first down. And they well, got they the had pace. to have Murray carry. Sorry, Matt. Third. And a lot of times guys get lined up wrong and it creates big holes. Pump fake by Jones. It got the receiver wide open. Ryan Broyles a touchdown. Well, that whole thing looks like we could be in for a shootout today. And Patrick O'Hara adds the extra point. On your under duress throws it away. And a flag thrown might be for intentional grounding. The Florida State stopped on its second possession. The big statistical edge to Oklahoma. That will continue. 
with another big play and a touchdown for Cameron Kenny. Seven yard touchdown. And 54 yards in just 49 seconds. The extra point good for Patrick O'Hara. This is Florida State offensive line. That time was the first time they really got a hit on Ponder. Ponder to throw on third and two. Nicely executed. Out of the backfield, Jermaine Thomas. And a long run down the near sideline to the 40. Ponder pressured off the corner and there's nowhere to go. Down at the 42-yard line, Frank Alexander. It's a lot different from being a corner. Not, he's learning on the fly. Yeah, not easy to do, Sean. The angles are all different. Moses Madu breaks a tackle. Got away from the grasp of Lamarcus Joyner. Got they didn't even, Florida State wasn't even lined up properly there. They're having trouble with this tempo as well. Landry Jones on target to Cameron Kenny. Coaches a pace up and there every everybody's picking the pace up right now the, the Sooners have them on their heels right now right down the same wide open James Hanna and another touchdown for Oklahoma for Oklahoma that one took just five plays Patrick O'Hara, no good on the pass. Third down and five. Ponder hit as he throws, incomplete. In the direction of Taiwan Easterling. Good play action fake and another good throw. And Broyles breaks free for about three more yards off a hit down to the 37. Can bench 345. Ball looked like it slipped out of Jones's hand, and a big break for the Seminoles. Well, now they're going to rule it an incomplete pass. They were hoping it was a fumbled recovery, and that's what the Seminole coaches. After further review, the result of the play is a fumble. The defense recovered the ball, 39-yard line, first down. Good, Good officiating. Job. Instance where the what an impressive young man Christian Ponder is when you talk to him. And another wall and up for grabs intended for Rodney Smith. Coverage is to Andre Jones, the leading freshman passer in the country last year. And threw for just under 3,200 yards. He hits Moses Madu. Those lubricated crowd, too. It's almost completely silent when the Sooners are getting ready to snap the ball. Juan Miller bounced off the hit. And gets chopped down inside the 15. Four tackling. He had 217 the entire game last week. Murray to the goal line. Touchdown, Oklahoma. <laughs> like to be balanced. In recent years, they've had a hard time running it. In order to be balanced, they've had to run it because they've always thrown it well here. And they need to carry this offense. That's oh boy, throw it right into the hands of the defender, Travis Lewis. <laughs> and the tremendous linebacker brought it back to the eight yard line. The whole thing up. It didn't sound healthy. No, it didn't. It was a cholesterol slider, but he said it tasted great. Andrew Jones had a lot of time. Throws to Rattery into the end zone. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Great effort by Rattery, the tight end. Refuses to go down. So it's a great effort by Rattery, and then it's a last year. Extra point good by Patrick O'Hara. I only had Billy Sands as a Heisman Trophy winner, Steve Owens as a Heisman Trophy winner. We have an interception right here. But Oklahoma has always had great runners. And you think through them, there's a ton of them. 
You go to Greg Pruitt and Joe Washington and Leon Crosswhite, and, and I, I could name 20 guys off the top of my head. In a quiet day today, just 33 yards rushing that last run negated by the penalty against Derek Mensick. Jones throws to Kenny Stills. The fresh 2 yards against Utah State, but it was a low duck hook that was lucky to get through. That one looked a lot better, and it's good from 39 yards out. CC Virginia Tech lost at home to James Madison. Georgia Tech lost to a Kansas team that was dreadful last week. Miami's losing at Ohio State. These are similar. Some of their base schemes. Ryan Broyles pushed out of bounds. That might be another flag. Yes, it is. That should have been. And it's Rick. Moses Madu has the ball sail over his head from Landry Jones. I would think we would see the end of. Needs the hook. Oh. Second and seven. And Ponder is a man wide open. Chris Thompson out of the backfield. For 28 passing for 113 yards. And under duress and taken down. If you're Jimbo Fisher, would you think about getting Ponder out of the game now, too? I mean, the result are back in 73. 52 yard field goal try now by Dustin Hopkins. He has more than enough leg to make it. Wow. And it is good. <laughs> that was a rocket <laughs> with the wind. One. Same play reviewed three times. Andy Jones managed to handle the snap, swings it out to Brennan Clay. Welcome to college football. The true freshman got laid out. Calhoun again and a first down inside the Florida State. Allen jumps off the screen pass to Calhoun. And there's Moody who laid out Brennan Clay coming with a hit along the bounce. <laughs> Moses Madu again. And it is good. Really good, solid guys. Good throw by Manuel, and Willie Halstead runs away. And I guess he was still on his feet because the ball's out and there are no whistles. And Oklahoma has it. Recovered by Gabe Lynn, the backup quarterback. I see a replay review in our fit to work. And he went to work getting the right staff together, many of which are here. And he also went to work recruiting, and that's your lifeblood. And he went back down to where they get. They've gotten most of their players at Oklahoma is right out of that great. Third down and 10. He's to learn the catch and he breaks free. Foot race and he scores on the last play of the game. So if you're Jimbo Fisher and you're. Dustin Hopkins the extra point. And it is good. And that accounts for the final margin. Oklahoma 47, Florida State 17. Coming up next on ABC. Stay tuned for NASCAR coverage from Richmond. Now for Matt Millen, Janine Edwards, and our entire crew, Sean McDonough saying so long from Norman, Oklahoma.